hello everyone welcome to my channel dynamic coder so today we start on a video that how we can make our flash drive bootable okay and how we can install windows 10 on multiple pcs or whatever iso image you have of windows 7 windows 10 windows 11 how you can make your flash drive bootable and install it in all over your organization or whoever needs it okay so let's get started the first step is that we should need a software called rufus so type rufus.ie and press enter so you can see that you are into the website https rufus.ie slash en and just scroll it down when you scroll it down you find the latest releases of rufus so we can see here we have multiple links over here and we need is portable because we need this windows 10 to install on other computers as well just click here and let it download okay once it is downloaded just keep it and the next step is to type download windows 10 when you click you can see here this is the microsoft official website where you can download the iso image of windows just click on it when you click here you can able to see that the first option you can see is windows 10 update so if you're currently using windows 10 and if you're looking for the update just click here but we need the official installation of windows 10 we just scroll down and we go create windows 10 installation media so we click on download now when you click on download now let it download once this is complete just click here press yes so you can see that there's windows dialog box over here let's wait for a while so you can see that this is the license terms and conditions scroll it down till the end and press accept again let's wait now we got two options one is update for this particular PC if you need to update but we are looking for the Rufus to install to make it our flash drive bootable to install in the other systems as well so just click on the second option press next it is asking for all the options just click on next and we need it for the USB flash drive and ISO image so out of these two options we need the ISO image we click on ISO one and press next now it is asking me the location where it will going to save so I'll save it in the document press save it will it is downloading now let's wait for a while my windows uh, winrar file has been downloaded now the next step is I go to my flash drive so I'll select my flash drive this is my flash drive windows 10 I just select as format and just keep everything as it is and start here you will find one dialog box press ok it will take some time and it will show you that the format is complete press ok ok so your your flash drive has been formatted properly now go to the rufus that we have downloaded here you can see that this is the dialog box comes up we select this flash drive this we have formatted select this as disk or iso image and select the image so here is the winrar file that we have kept on download press open so you can see that once you open this then they have find multiple options go to windows we just click it as standard windows installation here in partition we select gpt because we need uefi one just select uefi only here is the format if you want to rename your flash drive you do it we just keep everything as default the file si system as NTFS okay and the cluster size as 4096 okay and press click on start okay so we pressing on start here you can see there's a warning coming up just press ok So it's just creating our flash drive bootable. So you can see that it's 24%. So let's hold on for a while. Once this is complete, then you can use this flash drive 
in any of the device to install Windows 10 machine because as we have downloaded the ISO image of Windows 10 right okay so you can see here that the status is ready now and we will going to close this Rufus now our flash drive has been converted to the bootable one you can see here the name is also been changed because we haven't renamed we just kept it as it is so you can see the same thing okay 